Okay, in this video we're checking out the uh, Helifar H1. It's a pretty basic uh, folding toy drone with brushed motors. Uh, sends back uh, video, has a little camera here, to your phone via Wi-Fi FPV and records to your phone only. There's no uh, micro SD card slot in this. This one folds out kind of different. Uh, the back arms kind of twist out like this and the front arms fold out like a normal folding drone. So keep that in mind, this twists like this. You don't want to be pulling it straight out. I think that's how they got the uh, the props to go on the bottom. The props don't fold, but they do have a warning card in the box that if you do <laughs> uh, try and twist it the wrong way, the, you'll probably break it, so don't force it. Power run button here. You got a little uh, 1S LiPo in the back. Uh, this camera angle is adjustable uh, by hand, but I'm going to leave it kind of just kind of like that. A little bit of a down angle. And I just turn it on, and then it has altitude hold. This flips and rolls, has a rate button here. So automatic takeoff, landing, flip button, and uh, dual rate. So uh, slow or fast, and then you put your phone in here. That's pretty much it. Record video to my phone, and uh, we'll get the phone recording as well. Uh, pretty basic uh, drone, so it shouldn't be too long of a flight. Okay, we're connected here, and should be getting some video back. Quite a bit of lag in the video. Not sure if I'll be flying this FPV or how good the recordings are going to be. Well, we'll I guess we'll find out here. And we'll start some recording of video. Okay, so we'll do an automatic takeoff. Not a lot of wind today. But it is coming towards me. So the drone's going to drift backwards. And the first rate is just barely enough to fight the wind. You can see pretty much full stick forward here in the first rate. So I'm going to increase the rate. Ooh, yeah, so there we go. Second rate, definitely. You want to be in the second rate. Got some nice little lights there in the front. Oh, the wind is shifting around a bit. Now it's coming from my left. I'm gonna take it out to that little this little field over here. Take take it up. And not no one over there, so it should be okay. Got a pretty decent connection to my phone now. Not too bad. The video looks pretty decent for a toy drone. I am, I am trying to fly at FPV. Around. Bring it back towards me here. Yeah, I'm not 100% sure how much this thing, this thing costs. I forgot. Check the link in the description. Pretty basic drone, just get video, altitude hold, no no fancy GPS features, or anything like that. Obviously, it's just a you know toy grade drone here. Altitude hold seems to be working pretty good. Seems to be staying up there no problem. And I'm attracting some bunch of birds all of a sudden. This is a different kind of bird, fellas. Oh, the wind is definitely picking up, so I'm going to bring it a little closer here so I don't lose this thing. Whoa, it's going to go into the tree. It's shifting now, it's coming from behind me. And, oh, it's, yeah, you can see the leaves. The wind is shifting around and it's gusting. So there's no position hold on this one, so there's no optical flow sensor. And, yeah, this is, it's having trouble. having some issues with the wind and, and the wind does affect the barometer on here which does which holds its altitude so if, if your wind picks up like this uh, it's going to be a little bit tr trickier to fly all right let's try a few little uh, some flips here the wind is just going all over the place today really unpredictable so so it's typical flips with the, the, the button on the controller 
Okay, so you can't do flips, you can do rolls. And yeah, flips uh, forward and backwards don't work, but rolls left and right work okay. So this is the roll button only. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Fun little toy drone for the kids, I think. Let's see how far I can go over here. I was looking at the ground. Let's bring it back. Well, it's got decent range. It's not too bad. Obviously, I don't recommend taking it too far away. You can clearly see it, and, and it's, just, it's in a safe area. I imagine if it loses signal, it'll probably just fall out of the sky. That's what most toy drones do, but I don't usually fly too far away from myself. And the wind calmed down again. All right, let's try a little like slower flying here, proximity. Bring it closer. So you got a good look at me here. I'm just letting the wind take it back. What do you guys think of the video quality of this? Not too bad. I'm sure this thing costs well under $100. Flight time's not too bad either. I actually, I'm not sure if I charged the battery or not. Just kind of took us out real quick today. I'm going to take it up kind of high in this one here. Let's just see how far it goes up. And surprisingly stable, considering how windy it is. The you know, wind is gusting. Not bad. And I'm losing video signal, so I'm going to bring it back down. I think it's too far up. I imagine the video recording is going to be kind of choppy because it's just recording back to the phone. And if it's too far away, if there's interruption in the signal, then uh, yeah, it will uh, basically freeze. So I don't know. I'm not really paying attention to the video. I've noticed a few freezes, but yeah. All right, I think I got the, the gardeners behind me, so I'm going to have to end this flight. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below and I'll talk to you guys in the next one.